What is up guys, Austin Nerd Show here and today we're unboxing the loot crate for this month. And so the theme for this month is protect. So we have to use protection. Um, so let's go ahead and see what we got in the box here. So we have some sort of thing going on here. So we're going to start with our shirt first. And so as usual with the recent release, we have a Black Panther shirt as you can see here. And so, okay, this is a very plain design shirt. It is a Mar licensed Marvel shirt though. You can see the Marvel logo there. But we have Black Panther there, and it's just an all-black shirt with Black Panthers. You can barely see him on there. But I really like the form and design that he's in with the kind of like the action pose going on. But other than that, there's not much going on in the shirt, but I think it looks quite like the design. Simple, plain, and basic, and good for Black Panther. I just like that a lot. So that's cool. So that is our shirt for the month. And so next up here we are next time we have it looks like a figure of some sort. It says Loot Crate exclusive, the Expanse Rocketate ship, I think is how you say it. But it's like a rocket ship going on here. I don't know what it's from exactly, but oh, there's it's from the show The Expanse. Oh, I've never even heard of it. I didn't know it was a TV show. I think it's on sci-fi. Uh, well there's the ship, and so it looks kind of like it's a... Uh, I don't think it is exactly, but it looks like one of the uh, kind of goes like those figures we've got in the like past couple of months or we've got in the past where we got the West World and we got the um, Stranger Things. It looks kind of like that. Oh, this is kind of cool actually. I wish I knew what this was because it'd probably be a heck of a lot cooler for me. But um, let's go ahead and get this all out and put together. So we have a base with a display here. So we got a picture and everything to go on. So we have the base there. Then we have pegs that go into the board. I don't know if I'm putting this in correctly or not. But we'll figure it out, I guess. And then, so we got little pegs in there. And I did like how on the board there, it does say the expanse on it. And I like the blue design there. So we got the pegs in, and then we'll just stick the ship on it. Okay, so there I got it on the thing now. So that actually looks really cool. I like this display. Like I said, I wish I knew what this was. Because it'd probably be a heck of a lot cooler. But that is so cool. So I like the ship. So it sits on the pegs, but it also sits at kind of an angle. So you can kind of see it. A lot better instead of just from the direct side. It's kind of at an angle so you can see the top and the side. So that's really cool there. And so there's the look at it. We'll go and just take the ship off so you can see a lot better. So here's the top of it. So it flies like this, obviously, I would assume. And so there, the things are kind of crooked on the front. I don't know if they're supposed to be on, if you can see those, but they're kind of crooked. But there's the top of the ship so you can see all the design and everything going into it. It says, you know, the Rockin' A there on the top of the ship. I don't know if you can read that though. And then I like the flames in the back, the blue flames. I think those look really cool. That's awesome. And then like I said with the base and everything, this is just a cool display. Um, it'd be cool if they did other things like this, like, you know, like a um, Millennium Falcon or something like that. Just something that I'd, I actually know more about. Looks like there's some stuff on there but that is cool so we have that ship display from the expanse so that is cool then next up we have some coasters it looks like and it says pacific rim uprising coaster sets and it says they're made uh, legendary and loot crate exclusive so let's go ahead and open this just to see what's all on so they look kind of oh, i think i opened the wrong thing here we go so they look almost leatherish obviously i assume they're fake so this one's a oh they say uh pan pacific defense corps i don't know if you can see that yeah you can see that so pan pacific defense course and so it kind of has like a fake leather look in design to it so they all just say the same thing and they're pretty flimsy like they're not stiff or anything so they're pretty flimsy they have like a cardboard look on the back and you can see it says pacific ram uprising there with the legendary logo so those are kind of cool but they're coasters we get tons of coasters and i don't know with this material how well they work but you never know could work out really good then next up we've got a poster here it looks like um so it looks like it's fallout though i can tell by the colors and everything so there's our picture so it's kind of a big picture on if we can fit it all in there um i don't know a whole lot about fallout so i don't know what this is a picture of but it looks just like an old abandoned building kind of like someone's hideout or building thing you i can see like crops and stuff and some an old machine in one of the corners and then of course the building and everything there but this is actually just an advertisement for their new crate the fallout crate so there's all sorts of um, information there so if you like fallout and would like to get the crate you can go ahead and do all this and we have the um, e uh, link to the site there so you can go ahead and get that if you like fallout and want to do that so that's kind of cool if you are into that thing we are not so we won't be getting it but that's so cool and so that is oh and then we have our last item out <laughs> this is kind of cool so we have our pin for the month and the theme is or it's february 2018 with theme of protect and it's from how to train your dragon and we have a toothless head as the pin so this is just like a actual pin like you'd find in a store or something um, it's just like a picture on a pin and it's of toothless 
there the dragon of course from how to train your dragon so that's kind of cool i mean it's not very creative like i said you could probably any place that sells how to train your dragon stuff you could probably find these looking uh, this type of thing but um it's kind of weird that's in a loot crate usually they're more creative than that but it's so cool because we got a toothless pin so that is cool and then the box for the month kind of just turns into a safe so there's the front of it says loot crate then it has you know the um, dial and the handle there to open the safe so you can just turn this inside out and make it into a safe so that's it for the box this month so let's go ahead and look at see all the arms so there's our theme of protect right there so first off, we got our exclusive Black Panther tee licensed by Marvel there with the Black Panther on it that I think is cool. Hopefully it'll fit. Then next up, we got our Expanse Recon... I don't know how you say it. Ship Replica from Alcon Entertainment. So that's really cool. Like I said, I wish I knew what this was because it's really cool. Then we got our um, art print for Fallout 4, this picture here. Um, let's see if it says just licensed by Bethesda. So nothing real special going on with the picture. Then we got our exclusive How to Train Your Dragon pin from DreamWorks Animations. And the last thing is our Pacific Rim coaster set. These are exclusive to licensed by Legendary Entertainment as we saw there. And then you can go to LootCrate.com and check out all the other details and probably see the Mega Crate because they don't like to advertise it anymore now. So bro, what was your favorite item out of the box this month? I'm going to have to say the pin. Because I'm a huge fan of how to train yeah, sorry, you, know, you like toothless. Um, I'm probably going to have to say this just because of what it is. Like I said, I don't know anything about the show. Didn't even know it was a TV show. But I like the idea of it. Like, obviously, I don't really care about this ship. And I won't be displaying it. But I w want to find out who did this and see if they do anything else. Because I want another display like this. Because I really like the colors and the detail and design of it. I really like that thing. So that's going to be it for this unboxing. If you enjoyed, let me know in the comments down below. And don't forget to subscribe to see more unboxings. And we'll see you next time.